Happy New Year, everybody. Ed back with Silver Sport, and we got Chuck on the line. Hey, everybody, what do you say? What do you know? 2022! Yeah. And right? 2022? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you're going <write, laughs> to write it wrong for the first month like everybody else, right? <laughs> like so. <laughs> uh, so welcome back. Uh, we wanted to get a video out on New Year's Day. We got some other stuff in the hopper, but just wanted to give a shout out. Uh, you know, say thanks to everybody for, for a great 2021 for the channel. Um, I hope all of your 2021 was great as well, and your 2022 is even better. Uh, so a few little stats from this year. We produced on, on, on Silver Sport 272 videos since January 1st. So that's 270, and there's multiple boxes in some of those videos. So, uh, yeah, 300 box rips at least in 2021. Uh, we gained 4,360 new subscribers since January 1st, which oh, is awesome. Yeah. Uh, That's got to be just about every, anybody and everybody who finds us entertaining. Who can, I, I, don't, I, don't, yeah. I don't think there's more. <laughs> there's more or, can, or, or can who even, to, who can even tolerate us. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, so also... 876,600 views. Oh, wow. Almost a million views last year. Wow. Uh, and 121,214 hours of watch time on our channel. Just incredible. Holy cow. Just incredible. So thanks, everybody, for all the support. Uh, hanging with us, engaging with us. Uh, the chat, everything has just been... It's just been so cool being a part of this uh, for 2021, and we were looking forward to even bigger and better things in 2022. Absolutely, and even the you know the, the little bit of trading and buying and selling, yeah, you know, through the community has been awesome. I mean, yeah. I don't think we've had a sour experience, you we, know. We've had some ridiculous mail days. Thanks to everybody that sent stuff oh, into the channel. Geez, that's oh, a whole goodness. other whole level on its own. Whole that, other video, that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, also, uh, I am working on a 2021 Best Hits video, uh, so look for that sometime this week. Uh, it's going to take me some time to grind that one out amongst all yeah, the... Yeah, so you don't have to waste your time looking at 272 videos. <laughs> <just put it out. laughs> well, uh, you know, it's only the biggest hits. So, uh, so there we go. Uh, so, let's get into this. Let me One last time for Frosty. This will be... we got Santa back there with Frosty, right? So, it's New Year's Day when we're recording this. So Frosty and Hermie get their last Merry Christmas. Hey, 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 hey. Little booty shaking. <laughs> oh jeez. So one last one last roll for them. Bring out bring in the new year. And then uh, the chicken has been hibernating, vacationing, drinking margaritas, and getting ready for uh, some heat. We got Zenith oh. coming. Later this week, we got a bunch of videos coming, uh, so that should be good. So let's get into Collectible Card Club as we chat about our New Year's resolutions and goals, huh, Chuck? Oh, I don't know about that, but New Year's traditions. I usually take down all my Christmas crap on New Year's Day. Oh, yeah. Does anybody else have any New Year's? Uh, that'd be cool to hear in the comments. What are your New Year's traditions? Yeah, That's except cool. we've been uh, getting a bunch of rain, so all my outside Christmas stuff. Oh, look at that. I, I mean, they must know us, Chuck, or something, right? <laughs> you always send us a perfect set of two of these nuts. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. But, yeah, all my Christmas stuff outside is all wet, so uh, I think I, I, can't, I can't pack that all the way today. So. Oh, oh, yeah, it's been rainy here, too. What is this chase pack in here? What is that? There's some pro set. I don't want to smash it up with my finger. Oh, it didn't want to come out of the Oh, jeez. So, oh. so I smashed it out there with my hand. <laughs> and this is the type of jackassery we're talking about here. Uh, okay, so, yeah. So, New Year's... Was that a pack of 88 tops I saw there? Uh, I don't know, Chuck. Uh, that is 95 tops. Oh, stadium no, club. that one. Uh, I'm just tossing stuff. Pro set. Well, it's pro set. Contenders draft picks. That looks like a retail pack out of a blaster. It is. It's newer stuff, though. Uh, we got some Black Diamond 
99. Oh. 2021 Premier Draft. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, top Stadium. 99. Stadium Park? Or Toad is Hop Stadium. Yeah, uh, Stadium Stadium Club, yeah. Yeah. Oh, 2014 Prestige, but it feels thin. We've got some good hits out of there, but usually they're uh, they're chunky packs. Uh, what is this? Oh, that's that Black Diamond again. Yeah, but I'm looking for the year on it. 99. Oh, 98, 98. Okay. Oh. And then this is a chase pack, a wild card chase pack. Oh, it looks a little mashed up there. I hope the corners are okay, but wild card chase pack. We'll put that over here. 2015. Uh, 2020 Absolute Retail, looks like. Oh, that's, go, that's going in my set chase box. 92 Fleer Ultra. Oh, there you go. 1988, hashtag put it in your mouth, Tops Football. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I only have a Dennis Gentry and a Richard Dent out of that set for the Bears, so you're going to hashtag put it in your mouth and then put it in my box. <laughs> yeah, all right. Well, I guess that's, oh, this is 1988. When have we got an 88? Uh, so let's talk about New Year's resolutions. Chuck, what are your New Year's resolutions? Uh, I don't know. I'm kind of perfect. <laughs> <laughs> nothing, nothing, to, nothing to change here, people. <laughs> oh. oh, are you going to put it in your mouth? Uh, he's on the back of Howie how Long there. I mean, you might as well kick off the New Year with some good gum luck. Look at that. It's a little moldy. Um, oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Wrong with you. Oh yeah, it's good luck for 2022, don't you know, Chuck? I I put it in my mouth last year and it worked out great. <laughs> all right, we'll put the rest in. Shove it in. No, no, that's enough. That's enough. Hashtag <laughs> take it all, Ed. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh. Okay, so these are usually split somewhere in the middle. Let's see if we can figure it out here. Oh, there we go. Look, look at that mustache. That looks like Aaron Rodgers in his younger days, doesn't it? It does. Who's that, Carney Lansford? Mike Lansford. Oh. Uh, Mike Coffer. Sean Landetta. Oh, Thunder Love. Travis Curtis. George Rogers. Rulon Jones. I remember him. Uh, Doug Smith. Irving Fryer. Everson Walls. George Adams. Wade Wilson. Dave Craig, quarterback. Keith Gary, and Ed Too Tall Jones. Oh, no bears. How about that? No so. bears, yeah. Uh, so let's see. So, uh, all right, well, I guess I'll do my New Year's resolutions. Oh, what do you got? Resolution number one. Don't sell any more Chucks to Pat, or Packs to Chuck. <laughs> oh, that's messed up. <laughs> no more Packs to Chuck. He takes all the good hits. <laughs> I'm just kidding, of course. Uh how about a better one? Oh, you give those a crack? I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna put more stuff in Chuck's box. How about that? Yeah, I like it. <laughs> Harry Galbraith, Fred Stokes. Uh, let's see, what else do we got here for New Year's resolutions? Uh, I guess a resolu resolution for me. Let's see, I need to lose weight. Oh yeah, you do. Uh, um, <laughs> I probably, I probably need to be a, a little better father to my kids, better husband to my wife. Oh yeah, we can always strive for that every year, right? Like, <laughs> um, probably not lie as much. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, I tell you what, I, I, my New Year's resolution is going to be to spend more time with Mike Cox. <laughs> oh. Well, I think if I spent any more time with mine, I, 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 oh, never mind. <laughs> And there it goes, right down the tubes. <laughs> Scott, Scott Starting 2022 off, right in the shitter. Jerry and Connor, yeah. Oh, Mike Super Duper. Pulled an oh, autograph card good. of that guy, yeah. Uh, and he signs it, Super, Super Duper. Yeah, he does. John, oh, who's that in the background? John Elliott. Uh, 95, is that Dent? I think so. Yeah. Uh, Daryl Green. There we go. So that's that one. No, no bears there either. Oh, I'm, I, I'm really focused on tops. I'm trying to get all the tops bears cards for, I don't know. I, I mean, there's a ton after after the late 90s, but. Yeah. I just uh, I just made me another eBay purchase uh, this morning. Oh, yeah. 57. With some eBay Christmas money I got. Yeah. 
Well, tell us what you got, Chuck. Oh, uh, 57 Tops oh. Bears complete set. Ouch. Oh, So yeah. Yeah, that, uh, that tops me off for 56, 57, 59. And I only got a, I'm only missing a couple for 58. Yeah, I looked at that, too. I think you got a really good deal on that. Them cards were clean for being from 1957, so we'll have to show those on the video when you get them. Yeah. yeah. Oh, look at there. Fast Eddie McCaffrey, father of CMC. Wearing those kicker's pads. Wearing them kicker's pads. It's all about the speed. Uh, I'm telling you, that's what I, I, you know, my kid now, he's, he's 5'9", 175 pounds, and, you know, played a sophomore, played varsity for the first time last year, and uh, he's still wearing his same pads he wore as a six-year-old. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I keep telling him, I keep showing him fast Eddie McCaffrey clips. Yeah. I'm like, this dude was not the best, but every little advantage, including wearing them light pads, made him look a little bit quicker out there. Well, and the funny thing was, is he was really durable and used to, he was one of those over the, over the middle receivers too, that used to take them shots with them punter pads, right? Like, yeah. Uh, Ridiculousness. Yeah. Uh, yeah, for sure. Let's see what other what other resolutions. How about I got one? Spend less on hobby boxes. <laughs> oh, boo! Let's all vote that he fails on that one. I don't, we I don't, all live vicariously through Eddie. I don't even want to see that stat. What I spent on football cards this year. Oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! Uh, but no, yeah. I guess uh, I guess the only way I'll get to that is if prices come down. <laughs> cuz I want to cuz I really want to buy more boxes. <laughs> Elvis Gerback. Oh, these are sharp looking cards, little shimmy shine prism on the bottom there. Tim Brown Stadium Club. Uh yeah, so let's see. Now, but really though, uh resolution continue to make the channel better, continue to engage with with uh with the community which has been so awesome. Um, yeah, absolutely. I need to get in there and start chatting back I, I i very rarely do it i read every comment but then ed usually does all the replying so i don't touch it yeah and i'd love it if you'd if you'd reply <laughs> <laughs> oh you got mossed that's you a nice got uh, that's yeah. a nice you got mossed photo of him too yeah yeah that's a good one a little shimmy shine on the lettering there let's see if i can see that so you guys can see the, like little prism across the the name plate there See some of those, some of the like Stadium Club and the, the other one. Just the photos are are would be awesome PC cards. You know what I mean? Right, right, for sure. Like that that photo is just the definition of you got mossed. You yeah, know? yeah, for sure. Yeah, let's see what we got here. Uh, Corey Dillon, upper deck. Who is this? Cam Cleland for the Saints. Barry Sanders, man, the Lions. I think they're going to win this week. <laughs> Who they got? Uh, I don't even know. <laughs> uh, I forget. We were talking about it during the fantasy thing, but Mark Brunel. Oh, Jesus, I'm missing the Fiesta Bowl, eh? And an Antonio Freeman. <laughs> oh, Chuck. Why are you doing that? <laughs> Oh. oh, Irish are up 14-7. Start of the second quarter. Oh, there you go. Uh, let's see here. Pro set, Jerry Glanville. Bart oh, Bucks. Detroit at Seattle. Whoa. Oh, yeah, there you go. Who else well, Seattle? if we could beat Seattle, so <laughs> can Detroit. Go Detroit. Why not? <laughs> Dalton Hilliard. Uh, let's see what we got here. Shane, Nick Lowry, Johnny Hector. Irv Eatman. I love how they throw all this stuff in here upside down. Oh, there's Mark Carrier uh, for the wrong team. Oh, that's a wide receiver. That might be a different Mark Carrier. Our Mark Carrier was a safety. <laughs> Mike Coffer. Uh, Aloha Stadium Pro Bowl card there. Anthony Carter. Jerry Ball. And a Super Bowl card. Tampa Stadium. Oh, let's see if I can get this right here. Raiders 38, Redskins 9, 1984. Oh. Huh. Kind of cool. They should make these like downtown cards. You know, like the, the new version? Like somebody, they should create a downtown card with all that cool stuff in the background 
But the Super Bowl cards, that'd be kind of cool set to collect. Oh, yeah, that would be. Um, yeah, so uh, let's see. What do we got? So the goals for this year, just so I can get that through. Goals for the channel this year. Oh, we, are we got goals? Yeah. Well, I, you put I, some thought into this. I, I thought you were bullshitting. I when you gave me a, you <laughs> called me about 30 minutes ago and said, hey, man, put together some things you want to talk about, some uh, New Year's resolution and stuff, and we got to make a video. I said, all right. So I went about my business, watched some of the, what was it, Penn State, Arkansas game, yeah. and then, then the FaceTime call came through, and, and look at Ed. He's, he really meant it. <laughs> well, it's just like the rest of 2021, Chuck. I put a bunch of work in, and you show up at the last minute unprepared. <laughs> Cool card. What is that? Jaguars inaugural season. Sean Bowens. Oh, what's all the big red splash on there? Uh, that's just his name. Top Stadium Club. Oh. Yeah. Um, yeah, but hoping to hit 10,000 subs this year. That'd be cool. I think YouTube sends you like a little fancy button or something oh. if you hit 10,000 subs. Oh, you think we can get 10,000? In a year, I think if we stay on the same pace, I don't know. Do you think there's 5,000 more people out there who could uh, tolerate us, Chuck? <laughs> I, I'm surprised we found 5,600 that do. Yeah. Uh, Dan Wilkinson and Mel Gray. Yeah. Uh, hoping to get to more card shows. We already bought our tickets for the Nationals, so we know we'll be there uh, this year. Are we going to try to slide up to Vegas in, uh, was it March? 2015 Contenders Blaster. Uh, yeah, we're thinking about that, too. We're potentially hoping to make it. There's that big car show happening in March in Vegas, so we'd like to get out there and bring some content to you guys uh, from the Vegas show if we can. Yeah, I was, I was, uh, I was chatting with um, Ryan, uh, Sumo Manko Man. He, he was thinking that... Uh, oh, oh, we got an auto out of a blaster pack of Contenders. 2015 Josh Shaw for the Bengals. Oh, how do you like that? Round four pick. out of out of USC. Yeah, round four pick 120. Oh, out of Palmdale High School in Palmdale, California. Cornerback. Very cool. Uh, oh, it looks it, like in 2019 he was an Arizona Cardinal. Look at there, Frosty going out on top. Sixty-one dollar box and a hit already. Uh, 2014 Prestige. Well, let's go ahead and rip it. Why not? Oh, that's why the name sounds familiar. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Chuck, let's hear I that. remember this story. <laughs> Prior to his senior season, Shaw was suspended by USC after he had lied about how he suffered injuries to both his ankles. I remember this guy. He originally told the team he suffered the injuries while jumping from the second story of an apartment building to save his nephew who was drowning in the pool. <laughs> However, However, comma, comma. Devontae Adams, rookie. All right. Go ahead. In reality, he suffered the injuries after jumping from his balcony to avoid the police who had been <laughs> called by a neighbor after hearing an argument between him and his girlfriend. <laughs> I love it. Oh, yeah, that sounds about right. Domestic violence was looked into by police. However, no charges were filed. Shaw was reinstated in November and played in the final three games for U.S. <laughs> Broke both your ankles, running from the cops, jumping out your balcony window. <laughs> and, tried to, and tried to say he jumped from the balcony to save his nephew drowning in a pool. <laughs> oh, look at that. Trevor Lawrence, peak performance. That's kind oh. of a nice-looking card. I think those are, like, kind of, uh, I thought those were... Random, a little more random than. Oh, look at there. Uh, Jalen Wilder, rookie, and a tight end, Kylan Granson. We're still seeing him in packs. Another auto, Chuck. That's two autos so far in a $61 box. We are kicking off 2022 with gangbusters. Yes, sir. Uh, you can't. You I mean, football tight end, but he have his Colts, fourth round pick. Oh, you just pulling fourth rounders. Yeah, well, you know, hey. I'll take it. Was born in DeMott, Indiana, grew up in Austin, Texas, where he went to Westlake High School. Oh. Oh. He, he was not heavily recruited and committed to play college football at Rice over an offer from Harvard. Chuck, did we get... Oh, my God, Chuck. Brady White, we got another auto. 
Get oh, out of here. Oh, my. Ooh, 2022 is going to be hot. Brady White QB. 2021 he, contenders. Oh, I think he went to ASU, didn't he? Oh, that's not ASU. Memphis, that's Memphis, Memphis. Oh, he began his college football career at ASU before becoming a graduate transfer to Memphis. <laughs> wow. Where's he at now? But how cool is that? Oh. Three hits. Holy cow. Uh, this looks like retail. Let's get these. UDFA and not picked up by anyone. Uh, this is out of, oh, that's a bummer, but still cool. Uh, what is this? Out of a, oh, gravity. I don't know. There's probably not any kabooms in here. Is there kabooms in here? As a freshman, White was injured, missed most of his first and all of his second season, but he earned his bachelor's degree in business from Arizona State in December of 2017. Oh. There you go. Quitty pay rookie. Oh, Justin Fields. Look at that. Everything coming up, Eddie. Oh, that's a, that's a double. All right, well, you already gave me one of those. Oh, right? wait a minute. Right behind it is a, is a red parallel of Khalil Mack. There you oh, go. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's good. You are starting off 2021 nicely here. <laughs> yeah, Kendall Fuller Unsung Heroes. I think we pulled one of those out of the retail pack the other day. Uh, so Brady White, while not furthering his football career, he did receive the William B. Campbell Trophy as the top college football scholar athlete in the nation. Oh. So he's a smart guy. Yeah. Well, he got an offer from Harvard, so. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Dick Buckus on the front. What do we got here? Henry Ruggs, Calvin Ridley Purple Parallel, and an Acetate J.K. Dobbins Rated Rookie. Oh, I didn't even realize this is 2020. Oh. Uh, Chronicles Retail and a Jalen Rieger Luminance. Those are sweet cards. Oh, nice. J.K. Dobbins, clear clear uh, acetate-rated rookie. He's going to be good yeah. next year. This is, this is working out pretty good. 2021. Let's see what this chase pack is. This wild For card. For a $61 collectible card club subscription box. Three autos. Uh, Justin Fields, a clear-rated rookie so far. Uh, and you can't pick up a mega box uh, of retail for 60 bucks on the secondary market. <laughs> Oh, I thought that was Jamie Newman there for a minute. I was like, you, get, you were so 2021, Jamie Newman. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, don't even, I can't even read that. Jalen Phillips. Oh. Oh, Mac Jones. Premier. Oh, there you go. There we go. Mac Jones. Let's pull some more Mac Jones in 2022. Trey Sermon, Kyle Trask, and an Amari Rogers. Oh, and a Kyle Pitts. 12 out of 12. Wow. Man, that's not too shabby. No, it's really not, man. I'm telling you, a $61 box. Woof. And we got one pack left, the Don Russ. I'm, I'm over here sleeving up the 12 of 12 pits. Uh, we'll put him up there, too. That's pretty slick. Uh, wow. And then a Don Russ retail pack looks like here. Wait a minute. There's 12 of 12 on eBay currently of Kyle Pitts. Oh, yeah? It must be that was maybe it's a different color variation. They probably made different. Oh yeah, colors. this one looks gold. What color is yours? Uh, Aaron Rodgers. Uh, another backwards one. Big Ben. It's green, like a lime green in the back, and an Amir Smith rated rookie. Uh, yeah, it's 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 M MXP dash five. Looks like the card number. Looks like a lime green or something in the background. So that's kind of cool. Oh, yeah, there, yeah, there's one. Uh, number one of 12 sold on October 19th for $1.29. There you go. Uh, yeah. So another collectible card club. Three hits in a $61 box. Way to start off the new year. Thanks again, everybody, for all the support. Looking forward to a great 2022 for everyone. And thanks for joining us. And again, us. 2021, I mean... Globally and overall, kind of sucked. We're right, right up there with 2020. But for us and the channel, it was friggin' awesome. Yes, it was. <laughs> yes, and thanks for joining us, and we will see you next time. Thanks, everybody. And we're out.